In 1983, Motorola's brick-sized Dynatac ruled, but consumers wanted portability. By the 90s, Nokia delivered with pocket-sized tanks like the 3310, seizing 40% of the market. BlackBerry wooed professionals with keyboards until 2007 when Apple's iPhone made touchscreens and apps essential. Nokia ignored it. BlackBerry clung the keys. Both fell. Samsung rose with Android and a phone for every budget. But by 2015, buyers wanted flagship features for less. Xiaomi and Huawei conquered Asia. Transition took Africa with $50 phones. Huawei was close to number one in 2019 until U.S. sanctions crippled its 5G chips, proving geopolitics can kill giants. By 2025, Apple and Samsung duel over foldables and AI. Xiaomi and Transition lead the budget war, and Sony and LG are long gone. The rule hasn't changed. Adapt to what people want. Or disappear.